what's going on my notary family today we're going over the month of december wrap it up show you how i did cue the intro okay we are back so we're gonna start with i gotta do this video so i can clean this off it's already january on the first, we just have one appointment at three, which is not good. On the second, we had two, picking it up. And on the third, I had three, seven a.m., four, and a two p.m. On the fourth, I only had one. On the fifth, I had one. So Friday and Saturday was just one and one. So that was like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine for the whole week, which I'm grateful. I am grateful, but... My goal is, you know, three a day. Three a day. That's what I like. So, on the 7th, which is Monday, there was 2, 1.38, 8 p.m. On the 8th was zero. I don't think I got one text message. And it hurt my feelings. I thought I was, I thought I was out of the game. I thought maybe I messed up somewhere horribly. And all the companies didn't. Didn't want to didn't want to use me anymore, but so that's what I thought on it. I was pretty sad. And then we had one on the ninth at 545. And then one on the tenth. I was I went the two weeks before at the end of December. I mean, um, what is this? this is December. November was good at the end of the month, I think. You know, I was doing two or three a day. I only had one, and then here was one and one, six p.m. and four p.m. and zero on Saturday again. Oh, you know what? I think I think I had my baby this day. No, uh, I think I was just with my daughter. But anyway, look. One, two, three, three, four, five, six. Six. That's crazy. And the whole week. But, you know, grateful. We got a job. I'm alive. I live in America. There's plenty of opportunities. So I'm grateful just to be able to, to work and have a job. All right. So then on the 14th. We had a look at, what is that, 6 p.m. And then one at uh, one signing at 4 p.m. So the look is the WeGo Look app. Contract your job. You just go out and take pictures of of automotive damage, mostly, mainly. Pretty simple job. You just get the car, take a picture on the front, turn it to the side. They On the app, it tells you, it gives you a, a picture of what your picture should look like. So you get the front, you get the side, you get the side, you get the back. You know, you go all around, then you take pictures of the damage. You get some measuring tape or a yardstick. I use measuring tape. I don't want to walk around with a stick. And you, you know, measure the damage, take pictures of that, the inside, the odometer. It tells you it, so you don't have to think what your picture should look like. They give you a picture of what your picture should look like before you take your picture. Does that make sense? Anyway, so that's that. On the 15th, there was a 4 p.m. Um, there was a, a DMV thing and Manteca and an 8 p.m. So the DMV thing was pretty cool. It was my first time doing that. I got a call and they said, do, 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 you know, can you go do this? And I said, yes. I mean, it was, it was a text. I keep saying call. I got a text. I accepted. It. I went out to the guy's house. He, he, uh, it was only four pages. It took about 20 minutes. And uh, filled out the DMV form and it was already highlighted exactly where he needed to sign, where I needed to sign. So there was nothing to think about. The person, the lady called me and said, hey, do you have any questions? I said, well, since you're on the phone, let's go over these docs real fast. I see it's highlighted. Um, what are the steps after I do this? And I, you know, we signed the documents and the, uh, the, the pink slip. I sent her the picture and she sent some, a code back to write in for the money. Anyway, smooth process. I had to take a picture of him next to the car. And we did the 8 p.m. So on the 16th, we had a 6 p.m., 4 p.m., and another look at 8 p.m. And, oh, I got to call this lady back. So this lady was into real estate for a lot of years. And I told her I was, you know, interested in that information. And she said, well, you have my number. Give me a call. So I need to call her back. Um, 17th, I only had a 12 p.m. and a 5 p.m. just two. And the 18th was at a 3 p.m., a one-off so i must have had oh the 3 p.m was a one general notary work i just put i always just write a one-off because it's one signing then i'm off i'm out of there 
Then I had a 4 p.m. and a 10.30 p.m. And I think I got this one super last minute that whoever the notary, original notary was canceled or couldn't make it. And they needed to sign those documents that night. So they called me and must have been like, I'm pretty sure it was about 8.45. I just picked up my daughter. And they said, hey, can you go do this signing? It's, you know, and I said, look, I can, but some stipulations. And they obliged. So it was a good payday on that one. 21st, we had it 8.30 a.m., 2 p.m., 4 p.m., and a 6.30 p.m. This is the kind of day I'm talking about right here. One, two, three, four. Now, four for me is full time. Anything past four is, that's a lot of signings. So if you're doing more than four signings a day, ooh, because four is big. Especially, you know, driving, printing the docs, unless you get them all the day before. And I don't know, you know, you still got to come up. You might have a scan back. You might have to take it to FedEx. But four is a, is a full day. Then the next day I have 10, 10 a.m., 12.30, uh, 7 p.m. And what is this? 8 30 p.m. and a 9 p.m. I think this is five. One, two, three. Four. Yeah, I remember this day. This was five. I kept getting calls. Three of them was from the same company. So presenting those docs was pretty fast. And I think I did all of these. No, the last three. 7 p.m., 8 30, and 9 p.m. I got to the 7 p.m. at probably 6 40, and I got to the 8 30. At 8, and I got to the 9 p.m., I don't know, about 9, I think, 8.50. And I was out of there before 10. So I, I think I did all three of these, in, including drive time, in three hours. We was killing. I didn't, you know, I still explained my documents, but it was, it just worked out like that. I thought I was going to be super late, because you know what happened? I accepted this 9, 9 p.m., I accepted the 8.30 p.m., and I didn't get it right away. I accepted the 9 p.m. And then 10 minutes later, I got the 8.30 p.m. So if you are accepting appointments, make sure you check and make sure you you, you cancel if you need to. Um, previous appointments that you may have said, I'm ready. I, I accept it. And if they didn't assign it to you, sometimes it's, maybe they just didn't get around to it. And so that's what happened. I got the 9 p.m. And then... I got to 8.30 p.m., like a few minutes later, and I said, oh, no, how in the world? So I just, you know, I got to the, I get there, you know, 20 minutes early. And mo at, when you're at night, most people want to get the signing out the way. They don't mind if you come a few minutes early. Um, so I just call them ahead of time. Hey, I got your docs ready. Do you want to start earlier? I say, yes, please. So this was a good day. This was five total. 23rd at 10 a.m. and 1 p.m., which I didn't mind because I did five the day before. So I said, you know what? Two is okay. On the 24th, we had a 11 a.m., 3 p.m., 12.30, 5 p.m., and a 7 p.m. Did I do five that day? Shoot. One, two, three, four, five. That's crazy. Another day where I did five. Um, 25th was Christmas. I think one of these was a one-off, too. On the 24th, I'm pretty sure. Um, 26 at a 10 a.m., 9 a.m., 10 a.m., and a 1 p.m. Oh, I think the 9 a.m. was a one off also, where it was just somebody transferred a deed, so that was quick. So I just had three on the 28th, I just had two 6 p.m., 8 p.m., and um, 29th was a 1 p.m., and a 4 p.m., and the 30th. 3 p.m., 5 p.m., 31st was 11 a.m. I had a look at 12, 3 p.m., and a look at 4.30. So I did two looks that day. If you speak Spanish, it helps. Because there was like four looks that I got, and they, this one of them spoke Spanish. Um, but I know a little bit enough, to a little bit of Spanish to get my point across. But I'm not fluent, so um, if you speak Spanish, it helps. I did get offers two times, I think, once a month. This last month and a month before, where they asked for Spanish speaking. Now, I could present the docs in Spanish, but I can't communicate with the signers. 
If you speak to me in Spanish, chances are I can't help you. <laughs> but if I speak to you in Spanish, you'll understand what I'm saying. So if they don't have any questions, I'll present the docs in Spanish. But I think that's it. And this was the first one, 7 p.m. So we're not going to count that. So this month, I think I got an email from um, SnapDocs. Let's see. Let me see if this email is logged in on this phone. They send you an email for the month and tell you about your your month. Oh, yeah, it is logged in. So let's see if... Um, so our payment. So we did get paid, which is nice. Oh, December summary. So it says I did on SnapDocs was 49 signings. I drove... 1200 miles and my average mile is 24 um you receive a thumbs up three from companies four from consumers that's a total of seven out of 49 i need but some of those companies i do return routine work for the same companies but december was a good month Financially, it was the best month. Better than last month. I don't like to say, I don't like to say how much. I know in this community it's cool. Like we, people tell you how much they made. I just, maybe I just got to break into that mindset a little bit more. Because I didn't grow up like that. So my foundation is, oh, what's in your wallet? <laughs> you know, like um, Capital One. But let me show you this email. I don't know if I can show you without covering the total revenue. So it looks like this. So we have 49 total signings. And it's probably hard to see. Oh yeah, I'll do it like this. Yeah. And um, you'll see the total miles and there's the thumbs up. Three companies, four. So you get that, you get that um, email from SnapDocs. I did do some signings, a handful of signings where it was, it just came through the email. And, or a text message to my phone and they sent me the email. So that's that. So that was my December month. It was amazing. It started off not good. Look at that. That's the first two weeks. How am I supposed to live? And then, bam, look at that. All that. But so far, January is good. We have one, I had one Saturday. Um, two, I got one in the, in an hour one in an hour and uh two tomorrow one on the six one on the ten so far but yeah that's that that's my notary family um my notary family that's the month of december we are growing we're doing better thank you all for the support and the love and the comments and the the suggestions i'm gonna make the video on the debt consolidation papers. I still have a pack. I just did one. So um, I still have the pack. And I'll go over that with you. So we'll do that tomorrow. Okay. Love you. See you tomorrow.